Hello friends, and welcome back to another adventure with Logan and the Alphabet Law. Today is a beautiful day. The sun is shining, the skies are blue. Logan and the Alphabet Law have just finished playing football on the grass. As it is a hot day, Logan and some of the letters have decided to take some shade under an apple tree. But as you can see, some of the letters are having fun climbing the tree, and X, who's very excited to see his friends, is still flying around in the air having fun. But something's about to happen. What could it be? Let's take a closer look. Look how fast I am going everyone! Careful X, watch out for the tree! X had accidentally hit the apple tree and one of the apples fell down and hit Logan square on the head. Ouch! Logan got up, walked over to the apple and picked it up with a curious look on his face. I am sorry Logan, I was going way too fast, says X. That's okay X, I am just curious, why do things fall downward? What do you mean? Well, watch. At this point, Logan took the apple and threw it into the air. It went up, and then straight back down towards the ground, hitting G on its way. See? Why does the apple fall down to the ground, not sideways or upwards? Oh, I am not sure. Does anyone know why? G knows. It is a force called gravity. What is gravity? Allow G to explain. Gravity is an invisible force that pulls objects towards each other. Earth's gravity is what keeps you on the ground and is what makes things fall, in this case, the apple. Let's take a look at another example. Here I have a football. If I throw the football into the air, the football will be pulled back down to the ground. That's gravity, pulling the ball back to the earth. OK G, so what stops the sun falling from the sky then, if gravity pulls everything down to earth? Well, it's actually the sun's gravity that keeps the earth in a fixed orbit. The earth revolves around the sun at a set distance so it doesn't go too close or too far away from the sun. Wow, this is very fascinating G. Thank you very much for that. How do you spell gravity? G R A V I T Y Gravity Wow G, thank you very much for that. We've all learnt so much today. And fortunately, no more apples have fell off the tree. Haha. <laughs> and on that note friends, that is the end of this story. We hope you enjoyed it. Please feel free to give this video a like. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. You take care, and watch out for those apples.